Hey everybody, this is Sarah, um, Paranormal Sarah, and I'm sorry if you can't hear me very well. I'm actually homesick today, and um, I was blessed to be able to get off work actually. And I uh, don't know if it's strep or pneumonia or anything like that, um, but I think it was terrifying customers, you know, that I might have the swine flu or something like <sighs> giving them their phones. Um, but I am homesick today, so it's going to be me and dude watching some movies downstairs, actually watching some episodes with my friend, um, Mr. Constantino, uh, doing some fun things and, um, watching scary movies, but I wanted to tune in very importantly, and I'm sorry for the lack of makeup or anything, um, but a particular person passed away today that I want to make sure you know, I know it's going to be quick and easy for everybody to do an update and a blog and um, comments. And every comment, every prayer is appreciated. Um, but I think for anybody in the parapsychology field or paranormal field, or even anyone who's a skeptic or mostly a science person in this field, um, will know who Dr. Holzer is. And um, for me... Um, I really liked a lot of his work. He um, did some production and lectures, um, but for me, I was introduced to him um, after doing some research with Lloyd Auerbach and um, doing more about what parapsychology really is. It's not necessarily an accredited degree, but if you're a psychologist, which is what um, I'm working on my master's for um, and did for a few years here in Missouri, um, it's a passion. Psychology is... A very unique field. You have to care a lot about people and you have to have a lot of passion and dedication because a lot of what's out there is theory and understanding the human mind is huge. Um, you know for me my personal passion with forensic psychology making sure that people out there with mental illness which is one in three Americans has a cure, um, has something other than medication and a taboo to um, carry them out of the hospital. And um, the doctor who passed away this weekend um, was one of the very first people to coin Ghost Hunter and to be a um, parapsychologist, meaning that he did work on what is about the physical body and the physical mind and what happens after a person passes away, which I think is ultimately what any ghost hunter or paranormal enthusiast is trying to do. Um, he just, if you Google him, which I suggest you do, if you don't know who he is, I, um, a lot of people may not, um, look at some of the stuff that he's done. You know, one of my favorite things, I actually have uh, a thing of quotes that I share with my group, The Paranormals, and one of them is from his, where he talks about what um, a spirit is and how it gets trapped in the outer world and um, what happens and he believes that a spirit is someone who is in turmoil at the time of their death and that they're lingering behind but then someone asks him um, well, you know what exactly would you say is an analogy for a spirit or a ghost and he talks about it as a tire which for me was kinda unique um, he says quote the outer part of the tire is the physical body and the inner part of the tire is that of the spirit of the person the bodies are similar, except that the inner body is of a finer substance, detachable from the outer body. The inner body is what survives physical death. The two combined bodies, inner and outer, are what makes the personality. And I love that. And um, I think a lot of his works are going to stick with me, personally. And um, I'm sure he's out there um, teaching us, as always, um, possibly more so now, about what is in the afterlife and I truly hope that everyone does send a prayer out his way for all those of us who will be missing him and who truly truly um, genuinely appreciate all the work that he's done in this field so this is an opportunity to learn a little bit about the guy and um, be thankful that we had him here on this planet to teach us everything that he did um, but I just want to give that shout out and I hope everybody has a wonderful week um, pretty much it. Bye guys.